This game just looks so fun. I watched uh, Zen play this. I watched Seer play this. I watched Soda Poppin play this. Is this game hard? I've never worked as like a supermarket person before. As like a cashier. Do I have to do math? Do I have to like talk to people? <laughs> okay, let's mess with the... Whoa, what is that resolution? What is this music? Is this Muzak? Muzak. Uh, let's see. 1920 by 1080 at 144. That looks like sh. How do I reset this? That looks like dog sh. That looks like steaming hot dog sh. How come sometimes when farts come out, they feel kind of hot? Like to the touch. Oh no, that is not the right. Bro, what was the resolution at? Do you guys remember? <laughs> okay. I think it was. What the? Oh god. Oh god, I can't read. Oh. Why are you touching your ass after farting? No, no, no. I mean, like, uh. You know how in Japanese they say, like, something is. Samui versus Tsumetai? Is there, like, a version of that for, like, heat? Because, like, when it comes out of your butt, like, it feels hot. Okay, graphics quality high, mouse sensitivity. How come there's no... audio option? Welcome to Supermarket Simulator. Atsui Atatakai Atakai Atatakakatata Oh yeah, that's right! Wait, so is Atsui like Samui? And Atatakai is like... To the touch, it feels warm? But I feel like Atsui has been like... Used to mean like, oh, it's hot to the touch. Like if you touch like a hot stove, you go Atsui. I feel like it's not the same, right? Especially when the fart goes upwards, it warms you up. Ah... Yeah, atatakai means like warm. Like if you if you run a bath, it's atatakai, atatakai, atatakai. Atsui is for the weather. Well, I watched uh, this show called Documental where they have to. It's a bunch of comedians that are locked in a room for ten hours, and the last one standing wins all the money that they put in the pot. They have to like make each other laugh through various like desperate means. Whoever doesn't laugh, gets to stay. And one of them was like, beating this guy over the head with something, just like fucking slapping him, and he would go like, Atsui! Atsui! Like rubbing his head. Cause it like, it felt hot when he was like, slapping him on the head. So is it like, it's not the same. Cause like, Atakai doesn't mean hot, it means warm. Like pleasant. Like lukewarm, nice, comfy. It's not like Samui and Simetai. Anyway. Welcome to Supermarket Simulator. Atakai farts. You'll start with a small store and grow to an awesome supermarket. Start by purchasing goods to sell and place them onto the shelves. Don't forget to set the prices with a profit to avoid bankruptcy. Oh. Okay. Wait, we need some good, like, supermarket music. Hold on. There's no music in the game, right? You can, like, listen to whatever. Shopping music. Like this? H&M in-store music playlist 2023. I can't think of anything worse than that. Oh, I can only imagine. It's gonna be like... Coffee shop radio. Happy Nintendo music. Ooh. Or this one is sounds from the department store. This is kind of nice. How's the volume, you guys? Is it chill? Are you having an auditory panic attack? This is kind of nice. You know what? Let's purchase our goods. Market. Ooh, chocolate pick cereal. 
We have zero dollars though. Can we just buy whatever? Uh. Three cereal. Three sliced bread. Three flour. Three oil. Three pasta. Three sugar power. Oh, we have maxed out. Wait, I only have fifty dollars. Ah, uh, what can we get for fifty dollars, chat? A cereal and a bread. Okay, this this is a good inventory to start out with, right? Ooh, we gotta make a profit. The unit price on that bread is ninety nine cents. Let's make it like two, three bucks. Cereals two ninety nine. Let's make it four bucks. This is a Whole Foods. Wait, what the fuck is this? It's my bread and my cereal! Okay, now we stock the shelves. Oh my god. Wait, that's so many breads. Can you remember how many breads you ate in your life? Ooh. Put the cereals on the shelves. Aww. Strong chocolate. What is your favorite cereal? Like the cereal that is your go-to. The one that you always look forward to. Now imagine that cereal... And imagine... It being hit by a car. Cinnamon life? It's not... It's cinnamon death now. Cinnamon -am -am -am. You're so beautiful. Thank you, Daniel Lewis Aberdeen, 1998. You have a beautiful day. Wait, what is this? Uh, oh, I have to throw this away. Oh shit, I'm littering. <laughs> trash. Fucking trash. This looks like uh, New York or Chicago. A cozy little supermarket. Okay. So, set price on these breads. Set the price. Let's make it... Two... Dollar. Two dollar for bread? Like, I mean, like, that's... Uh, that's a dollar profit, I think. That's pretty good. Let's make this four dollar. I'd say that's a very reasonable price for... Ron sandwich bread nature without additives. I really hope one of those demon art ladies doesn't come in here and buy up all the bread to kill the rainforest. That would be so fucking annoying. Wait, so this is my little checkout station? I hope I can upgrade it to where we can get like self-checkout and everything is automated. Hey. <gasps> this is our first- oh god, oh god, everybody act natural. It's our first customer. What is it gonna buy? Is it gonna buy- <gasps> Uh, hey, sir, uh, just one bread for you today? I'm gonna have a, a party tonight, are we? <laughs> Feeling crazy, aren't we? Uh, that'll be two dollars, uh... One dollar of change, here you go. Here's your change. Not gonna tip me, huh? I see how it is. Uh... Approved. Oh, you got a cereal and a bread. Nice. Oh, doing card? Let's see here, uh, put it in there. Total is... Six... Dollar. Nice. Ooh, two breads getting a little crazy tonight, huh? Carb loading, I see. It looks like Trevor from Grand Theft Auto. Two sliced bread. Uh, that will be... <laughs> Four dollars, please. Oh, oh, oh. Two chocolate cereals. Damn. Eating for two, are we? <laughs> I'm just kidding, uh... You're not pregnant. <laughs> Yet? Oh... Here you go, ma'am. Two... Two breads for you, that'll be four dollars. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Damn. We're... We're doing pretty fucking good. We gotta be careful, though. We're... We're running low on bread stock. Oh my god, I saw the McDonald's thing. I thought I was dreaming at first. Whoa, this guy... He looks like that one actor that's like in the... 
He always looks really concerned. $4 for that? Have a nice day! Thank you, come again! I gotta perform 25 checkouts. I gotta check everybody out. He looks like the guy... What's his name? Jeremy Allen... whatever. Jeremy Frederick Wilson. The guy that was in the, the wrestler movie that me and Ethel watched. Whoa. Here you go. Oh, paying with cash, are we? We're just trying to flex, I see. We need one dollar. Here you go. Here's your change. You have a nice day. And, uh... Uh... Thank you. Fuck. God, no. Fuck. Fuck. They think I'm weird as fuck. Uh... Oh, hi. Uh... You having a good day? Uh, you gonna go home and eat your cereal and some bread? Oh, you paying with cash too? Why is everyone just bragging like that? Alright, eight dollars. Five, one, two, three. There you go. Oh, back again, I see. Uh, feeling hungry. Got a big appetite to feed. I think he's doing like a... some kind of... drug operation on all that cereal. $46 and change? Why did you pay with a $50 bill? What the fuck is wrong with you? Uh... Six dollars? There you go. What if I just give people more money than I'm supposed to? Just like, as a treat. Yeah, is he laundering money by buying cereal? Uh... No... no change? Alright. Um... Not gonna say hi? <laughs> not gonna... Make conversation? I guess I'm just a mindless drone to you, huh? We're out of bread! Alert! We're out of- We're fucking out of bread! Oh god, everyone's gonna hate me! I know, I know, I'm sorry. I know we're out of bread. The situation is a little dire. Uh, it's okay though. Wait. You again? Uh, $16. Okay. Nice. Uh, more chokey pick. Oh, this guy looks a little shy. Not having a good day, are you? I'm gonna go home and just binge all that cereal, just eat your feelings out. I know how it is. Uh... Bro, I'm so good at giving change. They should unleash me on the world and give change. They want me to stop all the wars, stop world hunger. Look at all these little chains. Oh god, my stock is fucked. Okay. Nice. Nice. Couldn't find Choco Puck cereal. Cause this motherfucker took the last one! Alright, card. Uh, your total is four dollars. Thank you very much. Alright, I gotta, I gotta fucking close the store. Okay. Let's see. I think we turned a pretty crazy profit. Why does it say, wow? Wow. Do... do... do wow. Do wow. Okay. How much money we got? We have $72. Let's buy... More choco pick. What about pasta? Some pasta? Um... Sliced bread. And we have... $19 left. Let's buy... Flowers? Um... Wait, no. We have $44 left. Ah... Uh, cereal? Everybody loves the choco pick cereal. Now we have $6 left. $6.24? We could buy more flour. Or... 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 Okay. I don't know if I'm doing this right. Oh, no! We're... Th oh, fuck! Okay, let's flower, let's flower. Okay, okay. We can buy more shelving... A fridge, a spotlight, a freezer... Another checkout counter. Can I, like, buy employees? Ooh... Product license. Purchase this license to be able to sell the products below. Bottled water? But oh, what? Uh, I'm gonna cause, like, a catastrophe. So everyone panics and has to, like, buy up all the bottled water. I would make a crazy profit. Damn. It 
it's 7 p.m. Should I wait until morning to open? Oh, yeah, I'll get some candy bars for those impulse buys. You hire them, not buy them? Same difference. They're gonna work for me. They're gonna be under my, my thumb. My crooked, disgusting, arthritic thumb. Let's see. Whoa, bro, look at this Tetris block of shipments that I got. More chuckle pick. Nice, 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 nice. Throw this away. Ooh, the flower. The master flower. Ooh. I gotta stock like a shovel, duct tape, and uh, sedatives or something. Ooh, all those breads. Nice, nice, nice. I like that they just sling your stuff onto the side of the road. It's very accurate, actually. They will just throw it out of the delivery truck and not even care what happens to it. Have you guys ever had your packages stolen? I used to struggle with that every fucking year when I lived in Seattle. I lived in the sketchiest apartment complex and every year around Christmas time, I would get some stuff to send to friends and family. And if I didn't hurry out there as soon as it was delivered, like if I was away from home for whatever reason, that shit would be gone. It was so frustrating. Yeah, those fucking pirates. All my neighbors are elderly people they couldn't steal from me even if they tried. Here's the thing, it's not the neighbors that do it usually. It's uh oh press enter to finish the day. Wait, I gotta put these prices up. Let's make these three dollars. Four dollars cereal, pretty good. I'm gonna make the flour two dollars. Cause I'm a bastard. You think uh the bread price is too low? We could make it two fifty. Will they be mad at me if I increase the price of the bread? Yeah, it's usually people who... They go around the neighborhood. They just stake out houses. And they jump out of the car, run up and steal the package and go. Like a hit and run. It's so depressing. Yeah, bro. Like, and enjoy the fucking children's toy I was going to send to my baby cousin or whatever. You stupid bitch. Oh, my store level got plus 81. 13 satisfied customers. Oh, income. I made minus 43. You'll receive daily bills starting today. Make sure to pay the bills using their computer before their due date or they will pay paid automatically. Oh my god. I'm getting stressed out already. Oh fuck, I can't handle this shit. Oh. Sorry, I'm closing the store for today. I'm having a panic attack. Sorry, I can't run my store today. I'm having a tummy ache. No. People will really steal anything. They'll steal the catalytic converter right out of your car. They'll steal your heart. Sorry, my supermarket is taking a mental health day. No, 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 no. We're, we, every business has to start out in the red. It's a, an underdog journey, you know? Alright, any minute now, uh... <gasps> oh, uh, good, good, good day! Oh, buying more bread? Bro, dude, you're eating me out of house and home. Jesus, man, you look like you're in a murder mystery or like a James Bond movie. It's two breads and one flour, thank you, sir. That'll be seven dollars. Thank you, have a nice day. Uh, one bread? Not feeling too hungry today, are we? <laughs> Starting a diet? Uh, let's see, your change is 17... Why the fuck? Why the fuck did I make the bread $2.50? This makes it so much worse. Fuck, I do not want to have to count for change. Um, just one minute, please. Oh god, my hands are getting sweaty. Um... 50... 50 cent, there you go. 
there, there you go. Have a nice day. Uh, whoa, jeez. Party night, right? <laughs> Ooh, getting kind of crazy with it, I see. Nice bow tie. What are you using all this flour for, huh? I'm gonna make some bread from scratch. You, you can make... You could buy bread that's already made if you want. It's only $2.50. There you go. Oh, a pasta. Damn. You're looking kind of greasy. $11. There you go. Ooh, $12. Feeling kind of risky. You're gonna risk it all tonight, huh? Making a cereal sandwich. That's actually a thing in the UK, apparently. It's called fairy bread. They just put, like, sugar and cereal on a piece of bread. Whoa, bro, that's, uh... A lot of flour. Six dollars worth of flour, I see. Uh, no, no thank you, no goodbye. Alright, I see how it is. <sighs> They're just taking me for granted. One day, one day my supermarket isn't gonna be here anymore, okay? One day I'm gonna close due to the health inspection. Finding rodent debris on the ground. And then, you're gonna walk up to the door and be like, Oh boy, I can't wait to buy my choco pick cereal and two pieces of bread. <sighs> oh. Oh, hi. You need help finding anything? No, just uh, looking around? Oh, okay. One bread. Ooh. No. Why did you give me a $100 bill? Jesus Christ, bro. <laughs> Holy fuck. Taking money back? You can take your money back by right... Oh, I gave two months. Should I just let her keep the change? Um... BAM! Did you see that? That was crazy. Oh... Uh... What the f... Why is everyone buying shit with $100 bills? What is wrong with you people? $97... There you go. You're just testing me, you see? You're just fucking testing my patience. Oh, finally! Someone has a credit card. I'm not trying to show me up. Must be drug dealers. I honestly, like... Whenever I have to go buy something in cash like that, that costs a lot, I always get so embarrassed because I think they assume I'm a drug dealer. 50 cent. There you go. Keep the change. Maybe you could go put it in a gumball machine or something and put it in your bum bum. You just stick it in your fucking bum bum. Huh? You happy now? You fucking happy now? You can put the chong coins in your bum. Mmm, coins. Mmm. Uh, 42. There you go. Oh no, he is disappointed. He couldn't find the choco peg. Uh, thank you, sir. That'll be, uh... Fuck, I gotta restock. I gotta restock. Whoa, look at this lady with her matching dress and heels. Fucking slut. <laughs> Wait, yeah, what about sales tax? Wait, hold on. More cereal. Oh, just pasta for today? I uh, like the suit, it's looking clean. Uh, special occasion or uh, nah? Making, making pasta for the missus or maybe the mister? Uh, I don't, I'm not judging. Do they ever take your 20s and test it in front of you with like the... To test to see if it's Monopoly money or not? <laughs> Bro, you could go to jail for a really long time if you try to buy something with Monopoly money. I just found that out the other day. I'm not gonna be able to stream for a while. Why is it so dark in here? Everyone's just coming into my dimly lit depression hole store to buy their shitty bread, their shitty overpriced bread. Here, let's uh, brighten up the space a little bit, shall we? We are low on bread and flour. And pasta. Let's order all that. I'm never gonna make a profit, am I? 
Wait, oh fuck, oh shit, uh... Jesus, lady, has got her boobsies, boobies out, her boobsies out buying breads. Couldn't find sliced bread. Maybe if you didn't have your boobs out, you'd be able to see past them. Wait, shit. Hold on. I'm stalking, please, please don't get mad at me. I'm stalking the store. I'm doing my best. I'm trying really hard. Oh god, they're all gonna hate me. They're all gonna laugh at me and hate me forever and ever and ever and ever. Oh my god, fuck, 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 fuck. What do I do? What do I do? They're waiting for me. They're fucking waiting on me, and I'm not here. <sighs> oh fuck. <sighs> oh fuck, I gotta go into the break room and <sighs> just fucking chill for a second. <sighs> uh, card? Okay. No, no problem. No problem. Two dollars? Uh, no problem. Uh, just flower for today? Uh. Uh, eight dollars and change? Uh, you're just really trying to fuck me over today, aren't you? Huh? You just don't give a shit. You think I'm just a fucking automated robot animal, just a fucking dancing monkey. Newsflash, I'm not here... ...to serve you, I'm a human being. Oh, uh, hold on just a second, sir. <laughs> this looks so shitty. What if the... What if they get really mad at me and they go home and think about how mad they are at me and then they don't want to talk to me the next day when they come to my store? Uh, card? Oh, thank you so much for paying with card. You are a lifesaver. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh. Jesus. I need some fucking empathy around here. It's like all these people, they walk into my store, they don't even see me. They look past me, they don't even see past my hazel eyes. They don't know what kind of battle I'm internally fighting every fucking day. They decide to rob you the next day since the service is so bad. <laughs> yeah, they just come up and just fucking like shoot me in the face. <laughs> yeah, man, I gotta fucking go into the back alley and just fucking chill. Just hit the blinker for a second. I'm on break right now. I'm on break. license using the computer wait we're store level three now we can get a product license to get more products can we buy it i don't think we can i don't i don't think we have enough money we only have 74 dollars fuck me let's finish the day okay god damn can't wait to go home and eat a fucking hungry man dinner and sit and watch reality tv and cry oh my god it's a brand new day Holy fuck. It's looking up. Is there a way to change my store's name? Bills? Oh fuck, gotta pay that bill. All bills paid. Gross. We have $69.21. You know what? That's not bad. Click the marquee. The marquee. Supermarket. The marquee. The marquee? The marquee. Wait, can I take out a, a huge fucking loan? This isn't gonna make me go bankrupt, is it? Ooh, ooh. time to go home and eat my dang dino chicken nuggies. Oh, ooh, ooh. time to go home and do my breathing exercises and think about how, how my gratitude for the day. I'm writing out how I'm grateful for. These are Russian food brands. Wait, really? That makes sense. Time to do my breeding exercises. I get a bunch of animals in a little pen and I just uh, put some pheromone spray in the air. I sit back and I watch with some popcorn. Pay off early. Okay, I took out a huge fucking loan. Now... 
Now watch this shit. This is actually a huge business hack. It's free money. Why not take it? You can pay it back whenever you want. And if they like call you up, like if the debt collect co co the, the, the debt collectors start barking up your tree, you just say, uh, just give me a little bit more. I'm sorry, I forgot. And they'll they'll go away. They'll understand. They'll be like, ah, jeez, okay. Oh, you little stinker. Okay, I got a product license. Now, let's stock up on a shit ton of stuff. Let's get some cheese. Some milk. Wait, we need a refrigerator if we get milk and eggs. Milk and eggs. Bottle water. Some more... Bro, they really love this choco pick cereal. But let's save our money, because we're going to need some furniture. I want... Fridge A. And then... Another shelf. Do we have enough... Do we have room for this? Let's see. Let's see. Take another loan to pay... Yes, exactly. If you run out of money and if you are finding it hard to keep up with your loan payments, just take out another loan. Easy. What's the worst they can do? Like, yell at you? Get mad at you? You need to be... You need to stop caring what other people think about you. Okay? Like, you need to stop getting yourself in that neurotic holding pattern where you're like, Oh no, they're gonna be mad at me. Oh no. The bank is gonna be mad at me and yell at me. That's the worst they can do. Oh fuck, here they come. Oh, oh ah! Wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait, wait. Sir, wait, wait just a moment. Wait just a moment. Let's put the refrigerator right here. Oh fuck. I'm rotating it, I'm rotating it. Nice. Wait, that actually looks chill as fuck. Oh, good day, sir. Uh, shit ton of bread and some pasta. Jesus, all those carbs are gonna go right to your thighs, bro. Nice. Imagine him, he comes in the next day and he's got like the like, chunky Squidward size. Taylor Swift? Of course she's buying bread. Sounds about white. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck, it's a GTA prostitute. <laughs> Where's her jet? Yeah, Taylor. Wait, whoa, she has a tramp stamp! Just like my mom! Oh. Bunch of bread and some flour? Blonde moment, am I right? She either buy the bread or the flour, lady. Like, either way, you're gonna get the same thing. Oh. Oh, shit. What are you gonna buy? Russian chocolate cereal? Damn, everyone's buying up that cereal. It must be good. It must be pretty lit. I don't know why I put in the decimal and the zero for that one. Dude, taking an Adderall and playing this game feels like what it must feel like for like when you have like a hamster and you put like the wheel in their cage and they get really fucking hyped about it. I, I feel like I'm a rat in a Skinner box right now. This game is like a, a sensory toy. Wait. It needs to be placed in the fridge? Oh, fuck. Yeah, I gotta keep the waters cold. Alright. In typical fashion, I'm going to make the bottle water insanely overpriced. Let's make it $4. Because running this refrigerator, it ain't cheap. Oh, fuck. People are waiting. Uh, card? Uh, nice. Oh, fuck. God damn it. Johnny sends back to buy some Choco Pig. Choco Pig! Flower? This flower? Weird, but okay. I bet one of these people has social anxiety and they're thinking like, Oh my god, the cashier is gonna think I'm weird and... <laughs> they're gonna go home and tell all their friends about how weird I was and they're gonna make fun of me. And I am. I'm gonna tell everyone. Oh my god, today there was the weirdest fucking guy at my supermarket job. He only wanted to buy a cereal. 
What a fucking loser. Oh shit, I don't know what to do with all this milk. <laughs> That's what my mommy said before she squeezed it all out. Five dollars change, thank you very much. Eggs and pasta? Pretty cool. Uh... Thirteen dollar. Thirteen dollar and two... That's a really weird amount. Wait, am I selling those eggs for free? I think they... Bro, they just got free eggs. I'm holding a, 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 a super special today. Super special. Super special today. Super special. Free eggs. Free eggs. Wait, I just got an achievement for hardworking cashier. Okay, let's make the eggs... Um, Six dollars. No, five dollars. They ain't cheap, they ain't cheap, I tell you what. Alright, what the fuck is this? Wait, this needs... Why does everything need to be put in the fridge? Uh-oh. I think I'm running out of space. Uh-oh, guys, I think I ran out of spi space for the cheese. Okay, let me get four dollars. That's a pretty good... Pretty good amount. Wait, did you just... Did he just shoplift? The cheese is too expensive for me? What? Bro, you're dressed like a fucking Wall Street executive guy. And you can't afford four dollars of cheese? Well, you don't deserve it then. Fuck you. My cheese is too good for you. Oh, card? Thank you. Broke ass bitch. If you a broke boy, just say so. Wait, it's bio eggs. Those are freshly laid. I got a little busy in the back. I got into the incubator. The CIA came to investigate the price of my cheese because they just couldn't believe it. Semi skimmed milk. Oh god, where am I gonna put the rest of this milk? Can I just like. Can't throw here? Close and drop. Will the milk go bad if it just sits in this box right here? Wait, bro. Let's make the milk. Fine, two dollars. I'll reduce the cheese to three dollars. What? Oh god, it's so dark. Jesus, lady. Scared the fuck out of me. What if she's like actually a... Uh, like a fucking ancient spirit. And she's gonna curse my entire family. 80... 91. Am I... Am I a good cashier? I can't tell. Do you think everyone hates me? Do you think everyone who comes to my store hates me? Oh god, we're out of everything. Oh fuck, this is embarrassing. What do we need? Um... We need fucking everything! No! Um, um, um. Pasta... Uh... Ooh. Coffee dark roast? Holy fuck. Yo. Everyone needs coffee. Close after 9pm. Oh shit. Oh fuck. It is... Oh. Just eggs and cheese? You're gonna have really nasty farts, my guy. Tell me about him when you come back. <laughs> I started the supermarket job because I wanted to make friends, you know? I wanted to reach out to people. I watched this show on Netflix. I don't remember what it was called. It's escaping me at the moment. It's like the easiest one letter title, I mean one word title to remember. But basically, it, all these people get put on an island and they can all like agree to win $100,000 together and split it evenly. Or every single episode, they can decide to vote someone off so that they get like a higher share of the money. Yeah, it's, it's not, no, it's not Survivor. It's like Survivor, but with money. With money and the greedy human spirit. Yeah, it, it's Milf Manor. So every single episode, they can either decide like, you know what? Let's buy, let's... 
let's get together and be friends and share all the money and just agree to care more about uh, each other than some stupid green stuff, you know? Because everyone deserves it. Everyone deserves a shot at it, you know? Is this the store my dad went to get milk? Daddy, I found the milk, Daddy. The milk, Daddy. daddy. Yeah. Are you there, Daddy? Yeah. The milk, Daddy, daddy comes. Yeah. Oh shit! I gotta finish the day. The milk, Daddy, hath arrived. Wait, we made. A Did we make profit, bro? I think we made profit. No fucking way. Let's buy a ton of shit. Uh, more chocolate pick cereal. Uh, they really like the flour and the bread and the panzati pasta. Why not just stock up on a shit ton of stuff so I don't have to repeatedly buy it over and over? Yes. 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 So anyway, they can all share the money or they vote someone off that they think is a asshole or they just vote them off even if they're a really nice person just so they can get a bigger share of the money and all these people have these like tragic stories of why they need the money like one of them is like oh yeah I've, i have five kids i don't have a job my entire family died i live on a farm i've lived in poverty my entire life I've gone through hell. And there is this one kid that was like, I don't know, 19, 20 years old. And he had Wait, a secret. Wait, this isn't a supermarket. It's a regular market at best. Well, I mean, what, what isn't super about it? You don't think I'm... You don't think my supermarket is good enough? What the fuck? I'm gonna... Fuck! I'm closing the store. I'm killing myself. I'm killing myself. Fuck! Anyway, the kid had a secret, and he was like... Guys, I have to tell you something about me. I'm actually... A millionaire. <laughs> but, like, he wasn't saying it to be like... Yeah, I don't deserve to be here because I'm a millionaire, guys. Sorry, I'm gonna... I'm gonna just take my leave now. He was saying it because... He was too nervous to tell everyone at first because he thought that they would judge him. Because he's already really rich. And the reason why he came on the show wasn't just to make money. And by the way, like his portion of the like the pot that they would all be like competing for, like the pot of money, would be like ten thousand dollars, which he somehow still needed for whatever reason. But he came on the show because he wanted to make friends, because he felt like discriminated against for being a, a millionaire, and everyone like turns his nose up at him. Nobody understands how tough it is to be a millionaire, you know? <laughs> Bro, one life! Thank you so much! I'm a millionaire now. Alright, close up shop. I'm going to the Bahamas. Thank you so much. Jesus Christ. Sorry for the disturbance, but today is my... Wait, no! Today is your birthday and you gifted me subs? What the fuck? Hey, sorry for the disturbance, but today is my Monday. birthday. What Shout the hell? Shout out to my fellow leapers out there. Feels birthday man. Feels birthday man? Oh my god. Happy birthday, bro. Dude. What the fuck? Everyone gets presents on his birthday. <laughs> Wait, bro. You, you didn't have to. What the fuck? Thank you so much. Happy birthday. Okay, chat. You know what to do. Everybody gather around. We're gonna... We have to sing it. We have to fucking sing it. If you... If I catch anyone in the chat not typing out every single lyric of happy birthday... I'm going to throw a hissy fit and just shut down this entire stream. And then make it... Like, show up to everyone's house and, like, glare at them and make them feel really guilty. Whoa, this coffee looks so nice. And a one. And a two, and a three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Molly. Happy birthday to you. 
and many more. Wow, today is another birthday. Another year down. Wait, what the fuck? You're born on leap year? Wait, no wonder why you're having such a huge celebration. You only get to celebrate once every four years. Jesus. Alright, time for cake. And then I bring in like a, a really big fat lady and she like lays down on the table and takes off her pants and lets her ass out. Alright, everybody, dig in! <laughs> you can make space in the fridge for the milk? Wait, how? Like this? How? Oh, fuck. Uh, sorry, I'm having refrigerator issues. Oh god, it's 8 a.m. Wait, does time not run when the store isn't open? When you're setting up shop? That's nice. You know what? Let's buy some more shit. I want to fill up these shelves. Let's see, what can we get? More pasta? Pasta... Pasta la vista, baby! Sugar powdered? We haven't sold sugar powdered yet. And more cereal, because why the fuck not? Let's see, we have $180 left. Maybe we should get another fridge. Or uh, a freezer? We could sell ice creams! That's $400. Is there another license we can get, maybe? God, I love the clicky noises. Holy fuck. I'm, I've been so hyper-focused on this game that I just... I looked at the time, it feels like it's been like three hours, but it's only been like two minutes. <sighs> Let's see... Four hundred dollars, required level six, what bills do we got? You know what? The bills aren't so bad. Let's save up our money. How the fuck do you change the name of your store, by the way? Management, hiring, storage, customization. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This is coming soon. Wait, there are more bills? What? So you're telling me that after I pay a bill, there's gonna be another bill? Oh my god, there's rent. You're telling me I have to pay rent every month and bills every fucking month, every every day for the rest of my life and until I die? This is why I need anime. Okay, more cereal. I watch anime to escape, not to be reminded of real life issues. That's why I play video games. Because I have many lives. Adulting sure does suck, guys. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna fucking do it! <laughs> Susu. Is that like a sim Sims language thing? Like when they say goodbye? Susu. Alright, so my shelves look uh, schizophrenic at best, but it's gonna have to do. And we have this rotting milk right here in case of a uh, milk emergency. Oh my god. In my man cave, I want a, like, a piece of pizza behind some glass that I can shatter and there's a sign next to it that says, In case of emergency, break glass. <laughs> in case of hangry emergency. Susu means milk in some places. Mmm, susu. <laughs> Is it because that's the sound you make when you're, when you're sucking from a teat? Susu, susu, susu. Let's open this bad boy up. I need more hype music. I need, like... What's really good for when you just like chugged and snorted Adderall and you're pretending you're running a supermarket? Mmm. Tekken music. <laughs> Mommy, clean me up. <laughs> what band is that? Death Grips. Um, 90s rave music. Or like, bro, that music from the Blade soundtrack that's like, don't, 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 don't. 90s rave music, let's see, 90s rave mix. Yeah, this supermarket music is putting me to sleep. 
Yo, this is... This sounds pretty good. Ay, ay, ay. Continue. Running a supermarket is basically like playing DDR. You're on your feet all the time. You have to be fast on your feet. And there's some really cool music playing. Oh, I want to open up a supermarket in Japan. I want to... I want to sell bottled up high school girl fragrance. 18 year old high school girl fragrance. So, uh, nobody's gonna come into my store and uh, buy anything? Uh, eh? Whoa, this coffee is gonna be a big fucking hitter. Wait, don't buy it yet. I'm adjusting the price. Uh, shit, do you think he'll be mad? Do you think he'll be mad if I change the price while he's buying it? And be like, um, actually... Let's make this $11. Cause I'm a bastard. I'm a fucking bastard of all hell. I deserve to die. Anything else I need to set the price as? Um, oh, sir. Uh, yeah, sorry about that. There was a price error on our coffee. Uh, $17. And two cents. Nice. Ay, ay, ay. And you got one dollar with beans. Ooh, back again from uh, haunting the, the wreckage of the Titanic, I see. Say hi to the wife and kids for me. Oh, hey, what's up, Taylor? Uh, how, how are things with Travis? <laughs> Those eggs are starting to dry up. You better hurry. <laughs> God, I, I think this guy's gonna fucking kill me. I think this guy is gonna follow me when I walk home from work and just fucking kill me. Uh, have a nice day! <laughs> this guy is gonna hide in the bushes outside my apartment at night. Ay, ay, ay. Wake up, samurai! $23, very nice. Nice and even. Oh, hello there, good sir. Indubitably, uh, $94 paying in a hundred dollar bill, I see. Really trying to show that you're made of money, I see. Fuck! No! Take it back. Take it back. Uh... Yes! Couldn't find tea. Palace tea black. Oh, they want tea? I'll give you some tea. I'll give you some fucking tea. You say that about every man you meet? Well, you gotta be careful. <sighs> I feel like Nyan has a whole playlist of kind of racist songs about Japan. <laughs> the worst part is I can actually think of like at least three songs that would be on that playlist. Number one, Butterfly by Smile DK. Number two, Japanese Boy. Number three, uh, turning Japanese. And then the last one would be, I don't know the name of the song, but the horrible, like, stereotypical music that always plays when, like, uh, there's, like, a show and they go to any kind of Asian country. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. Just, just imagine it in your head. The bottled water is too expensive. Oh, you're gonna cry about it, huh? Oh no, I can't buy water because it's too expensive. I have to feed my three kids. I have to buy baby formula for my three kids and I can't afford water. Go home and cry about it. Skill issue. Go, go, Godzilla. Ah, yeah, I like the Japanese boy song. It's fun. Do, 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 do. I have to stop fucking having children, huh? Oh, I have too many mouths to feed. Oh, uh, where do you think the mouths came from, huh? They didn't, they didn't come from uh, nowhere. You squeeze them out of your pussy somehow. Just delete them. 
Okay, now I finally put the rotting curdled milk up on the shelf. Fine, I'll reduce the price of the water because everyone's being a fucking whiny baby about it. Nice. 32. Yeah, you don't just get pregnant out of nowhere because some supernatural being did it to you. Immaculately? Card? Okay. God, I want someone's card to decline so bad. I want to be in that position. I've been on the receiving end of that, like, uh... Where, like, you go buy a bunch of shit at the grocery store and your shit declines and you have to stand there really awkwardly and be like, Oh, uh, can you try it again? And they try it again and it still doesn't work and you just gradually get more and more, like, the, the knot in your stomach gets bigger and bigger and you feel like you're gonna fucking, uh, throw up and cry. And the cashier is, just, like, completely impatient and just wants to get on with her day. Oh, fuck, it's dark in here. Ah! Yeah, just start crying. What do you even do? Like, do you have to, like, put everything back while everyone in the store stares at you? Do you have to do, like, a walk of shame? In my experience, they just, like, they keep it... They just keep all the shit you bought. And, like, put it, like, set it aside and don't let you touch it. You're not allowed. And then they have to go put it back. Ooh. Interesting items today, sir. I'm keeping a profile on every single customer based on what they buy. Hmm, this lady's buying pasta. And she's wearing an orange raincoat. She's definitely the type of woman that always does her does her all and is always giving more than she receives. She never really t takes time to take care of herself, you know? She's always thinking of other people. I'm going to make profile on every single customer and then like find where they live and track them down with like get in break into their house with night vision goggles, put a just like sedate them with a blow dart. Kidnap them into a, like a van and take them to a, like an underground basement area and put them in several like jigsaw style traps based on the problems that I found with them. This guy, what is he gonna buy, huh? Better not fucking steal anything. I will have your fingers. Around the world, around the world. Nice. I'm in heaven right now. Do you think my cashier thinks these thoughts? Yeah, that's the thing. Everyone with like social anxiety who's like, Oh man, I'm so scared to go shopping because like I'm so awkward with cashier thinks I'm weird. And I say something weird and they... I don't know. You don't need to worry about that. But what you do need to worry about is the cashier... Having like a spreadsheet on their little computer that you don't see it. They, they don't just like type in like what you're buying and totals and shit like what I'm doing right here. They have another screen, a uh, secret <laughs> hidden monitor, kind of like uh, blackjack dealers have at their the blackjack dealing station. And they have like a little like Google spreadsheet that they type all your information into. Based on what you buy, what you're wearing, the expression that you have on your face, whether you're having a good day. That's why they're asking you like every time like, uh, so how's it going? If you answer like, oh, it's good. They make like a little, a little mark. They take some of your dead skin cells too. It's covered on like everything that you buy. That's why they want you to get a membership. Yeah, so you keep coming back and so that you can uh, get their, they can get your phone number. Five hundred fucking dollars? Oh, market prices changed for the sugar. Let's see. Ooh. Market price, 580. Okay, okay. I don't know what that means, but okay. Pay our bills. World, world, world. Management. Ooh, let's 
let's get section two to expand our supermarket, shall we? Bro, I feel like a baby that has like sensory toys in front of it. This is so satisfying. I wonder why everyone loves this game. Everybody really around it. Wait, can I carry this entire asking thing? Where to find something in your store, Ooh. or do they find everything just fine? Do you get a lot of customers asking where to find something in your store? Do they find everything just fine? Well, my store is the best store in town, and uh, if they can't find anything, that's their problem. They're just a big fucking complainer. Okay, I don't know where to put this refrigerator. Would it be weird if it was like right here? Kind of blocks stuff. Let's put it, um, on this wall. It's gonna look awkward right now, but trust, trust my vision. Trust my vision. I mean, that doesn't look to totally bad. Okay, let's see. Mock it. Let's buy another shelf. And why not a bigger fridge? Oh god, I have no money. Fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Okay, not yet, not yet, not yet, not yet, not yet. What do we need? We have a ton of cereal. We need more coffee, flour, sugar, pasta. Yeah, if they want bread on the left, they got bread on the left. They want bread on the right, they got bread on the right. It's easy. Honestly, if they come up to me and ask me like, Oh, excuse me, where's the... Where's this? Where's the bottle of water? It's kind of rude. Like, Google it, bro. Google is your friend. Let, let me Google that for you. That is like the most insufferable type of person. I'm so sorry. The type that's just like... You're just like making like a polite conversation like... Oh yeah, like that movie. When did that come out? And they're like... I don't know, man. Just Google it. Or they do the passive aggressive thing where they go to the like... Let me Google that for you website and type it in and send it to you. That is like the most pettiest, most annoying baby bitch shit. You, in the time that you spent to be passive aggressive, you could have just either been fully aggressive, which would be less gay and lame, or just like answered the question, bro. What the fuck is wrong with you? Yeah, I'm talking about you. Open the store. Wait, I gotta buy more shit. Buy more shit. We have enough cereal. We need flour. We need some sugar. We need some pasta. And that guy wanted tea, didn't he? Okay. And more coffee. Coffee. Oh, fuck. You know what? Do we need pasta? Do we need sugar? We don't need sugar. We don't need fucking flour. Fuck it. YOLO. Yeah, I'm not gonna install a smoke detector in my store, YOLO, you know? Oh fuck, my shit is here. What is this? Coffee? Put the coffee here? God, $11 coffee? Products must be same? Oh fuck. I really messed this up, didn't I? I really screwed the pooch on that one, really fucked that dog. Daft Punk is the only one that can get away with a loop this long. <laughs> I, have, I didn't even notice it was looping. Whoa, this is that like high quality shit that comes into the tin can. Ah, uh, you slipped on the on the floor because I didn't put a wet floor danger sign in my supermarket. A uh, skill issue? Oh, hello there, sir. Couldn't find eggs. Oh, fuck. He needs bio eggs. A lot of tea. What are you gonna do? Throw it over the harbor? <laughs> Am I right? <laughs> fuck you. I fucking hate you. I hate everything about you. Yeah, you fucking walk home. You think you're safe, don't you? You think you're safe walking down the street with your groceries, huh? Oh, fuck yeah. I love this song. We're so low on flour. Why didn't I buy more flour? Why didn't I do that? Oh god, I set the price the tea. Four dollars. I think that's reasonable. Four dollars for tea? I think that's fine. Oh, horrible. 
Oh, is the music loud or not? Is the music okay or not? Is music your life or no? I don't really want to hang out with anybody whose music, whose, uh, music is your life. That's just like not the right vibe for me. Three dollars. You need lecipedes oil? You want fucking centipede oil? Okay, if there's a demand, then there shall be a supply. <laughs> Bro, that sounds like a... Something really horrible, like a horrible pickup line, you could say. Room for one more? Oh fuck, someone's here. Who is that? Go away! I'm not ready yet! Jeez, leave me alone! Ugh... Buying two whole boxes of sugar and tea? This guy's being so weird to me. Jesus. Um, sorry. I have a boyfriend. Twenty-four dollars. Bro, I feel... I feel hypnotized by this game. It somehow, like... I feel like my brain is in a vice, like a vice grip. La da da, la da di, la di da, la da di, la di da, la da di, la di da. Oh fuck, we're out of flour. Lock the fuck in, we gotta buy flour. Okay, we have a hundred dollars, let's buy... You know what, let's buy some more eggs. Why not? Why not? Why the fuck not? What the fuck is all this? Okay, let's put the flower on the bottom shelf next to the pasta. I feel like that's pretty aesthetically pleasing. Jesus, lady, wait. So impatient. Everybody just wants a piece of my store, I see. This game needs a rhythm component. Oh my god, like when you're doing like the checkout. God, I wonder when I can get to the point where I can, like, hire people. Okay, where should the oil go? Imagine Let's coming make it into top a market shelf. And the only employee, the owner, is frantically ordering more stuff they've ran out of. <laughs> and, like, scratching my ass and hyperventilating. Just, please, please, wait just a moment. I'm sorry, 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 I'm sorry. Please don't be mad at me. I, I promise I can be a good cashier. Oh god, they're thinking about how much they hate me. They're gonna make up weird rumors about me. Bro, my cashier is freaking tweaking. Fuck. The oil must be priced. That lady who wanted this oil is gonna be so fucking happy. Oh, you're waiting for me to check you out? Alright. I checked you out. <laughs> that means I, I looked at you. And I like what I see. <laughs> oh, you couldn't find the cheese? Don't worry, I'll stock that up for you. Specifically for you. Every cashier has their favorite customer. The one that they always think about when they go to sleep at night. The one that gives them butterflies in their tummy. The one that they want to follow home and watch as they put the groceries that they bought into the refrigerator. I wonder what they look like when they're just going about their day. $83. Oh fuck, it's getting dark in here, folks. Uh, I like to run my supermarket with like dim lights because I have sensory issues and the bright lights kind of make me go into a frenzy. POV. You're having a ADHD, BPD, uh, anxiety attack moment while running your supermarket store. And it's just like a vertical video of me just repeatedly kicking and punching the wall in here while the customers are waiting for me to check them out. Fuck! 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 Okay, bread, bread, bread. What are you gonna do with all this bread and all this water, lady? I'm just imagining her just like filling up a bathtub with water and putting the bread in there until it gets really soggy. And just like sitting in it. 
Maybe she's gonna put all the bread into like a big bucket in like a little basin and stomp on it with her bare sockless feet. $24? Um, merp, that'll be $24, pretty please. That lets me <laughs> used to keep it for the card reader. Oh, a moderate update that lets me use the key. Oh, bro. Yeah, that would be sick. That would be sick. Wait, what do you mean? <laughs> oh, we need more lighting in here, bro. Let me check these people out real quick. I'll be with you in one moment, please. I have to buy a light. <laughs> oh, ding ding! Wow, everybody... Everybody's so excited to go to my store. I hope you guys are my customers forever and ever. I'll see you in my dreams tonight, red coat woman. Okay, let's close her up. Pretty good day. Pretty good day at the store, I must say. We need milk, eggs, uh, more choco pick, flour, breads. Damn, it was a successful day, all things considered. Let's finish her up. This looks fun. Bro, you have no idea. This game is like crack. I understand why everyone's playing this now. I can't fucking stop. The gameplay loop is intoxicating. Here's my eggerinos. <laughs> POV the random girl is the cashier at the supermarket. Uh, merp, uh, popsicle stick. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> Are you checking out for today? You, you, you just want some, uh, you want change and I gotta use card? <laughs> uh, Earth to Planet customer. Uh, uh, you gotta have to take your card out of the keypad. It's approved. <laughs> you got heckin' approved Arena. Yay! Yay! What is this box doing in the middle of the street? Grimes cashier. I'm just reading the communist manifesto and I'm ignoring you. Just one moment. Uh, I'm becoming based. Okay, pasta. We need bread. Bread and coffee. Oh. 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 Bled. Let's buy as much bread as possible. Do we need milk? We do need milk. Damn, tea stocks are down and so is flour. Oh. We have $157. I don't think that's enough to get more furniture. Bro, oh, we gotta pay bills. Um. Not too bad. Oh god, the rent is going up because we expanded. Oh fuck. Get a cashier. The daily wage is 80. And then there's like an upfront $100 hiring cost. Zombie nation. Zombie nation. Alright. Stock her up. Let's put this right here over the shelves so people can see more clearly. Does your mom ever yell at you for like playing games in a dark room? Saying like, you're gonna ruin your vision? Hear about that guy that gouged out his eyes at the fish concert? Apparently... He didn't actually gouge out his eyes, it just looked like it. He like hit his head. I mean, I... <laughs> Not the worst thing I would do to myself if I had to sit through a fish concert, I'm gonna be real. Oh fuck, this is awkward. There's one bread left. I'm just gonna awkwardly leave it in the corner. <laughs> Awkward turtle. <laughs> ah, the voices in my head are telling me that you need to come to the dark side because we have cookies. Okay, full up on milk. Nice. Infinite milk job. Infinite power. Where's the cheese? <gasps> Oh, bro. We need cheese. The people need cheese. They've requested it. They're crying. 
I should have bought a shit ton more, but you know what? I don't want to waste too much money. We got to pay off our loan. Mmm, stinky. My store is still closed? I know, I know, I know. I'm still... I'm still working on it. I'm still setting it up. I feel like... I don't know. The shelf is a little empty still. What could we get? We have a shit ton of coffee, a shit ton of tea. Mm -hmm. We still have $98 left, so might as well stock up. Blah, 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 blah. Should we just get... More sugar, more sugar. More sugar. Ah, 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 ah. More sugar. And more choco cereal, please. There we go. Alright! We have oil. And now we have cereal. You have Uno! Okay, okay, okay. Why are you closed? Why are you closed to the public? Okay, we put that susu down. Wait, why did I get so much fucking sugar? What is wrong with me? Why is there like one bag of pasta just over here? Can I like move this? Please tell me I can move it. Oh my god, I love this song. I can't. Bro, I can't pick it up. Is there a way to pick it up? You can use the em <gasps> I can use empty boxes to move stuff? Okay, okay, okay. Um... Um... Fuck, I don't have an empty box. Oh, fuck. What have I done? Oh! Okay, I'm gonna do something really dumb. Uh... Fuck. No, I, I can't. Um... You know what? Let's just buy something to get an empty box. Wait. Can we? All the shelves are full. What the fuck have I done? Can you move the products on shelf? Only if you have an empty box. I have a box with one bread in it. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna open the store. Wait for someone to buy... This, like, last... Bag of pasta and then just, like, fill this up with more stuff. Coffee! Mm -hmm. It's fine, it's fine. They're not gonna look at it and get really grossed out and think I'm stupid. Yeah, we need to get more shelves. Next order of business. More shelving units? And then pay off our loans gradually. By getting another loan. Um... Oh god. The situation is so fucked. The situation is so dire and so over. Everything is fucking ruined. It looks so dumb now. Stop! It's not my fault! Can you buy a gun to deal with shoplifters? I'm gonna put like a trap door and I like hit a button and they fall through it into a, an alligator lava lake. Fuck. And the sharks have laser beams on their heads. What the fuck? Why did I put in $716? I think I did accidentally take two Adderalls. I feel like inhuman. I've, I've, I don't feel human right now. I feel like an, an automaton. I feel like someone's gonna make like a thought-provoking video game about me. Oh. I have just like a complete tunnel vision. All I can think about is supermarket. I'm running my store. I'm fucking disassociating at the supermarket. Wagey, wagey, get in KG. Mommy, mommy, bring my milky. Need it fast and hasty. Good and tasty. Thank you. That looks like the kind of girl that would ruin somebody's life. Are you excited for the new Pokemon game? 
I've never played a Pokemon game in my life, so I just, uh... I don't know. I don't know much about Pokemons. Alright, one gallon of milk? Is that all? What's wrong with everything, uh, everything else in my store, huh? You're turning up your nose at me? Huh? Huh? Why is nobody gonna buy that last fucking thing of pasta? Come on! Awkward pasta moment! Gay eggs, cereal, and oil? Okay, uh... Rubber glove, Pringles can, and Vaseline? <laughs> uh, Ziploc bag, uh... Raw chicken breast and oil? You know how many layers that model is? M my model? It's infinitely layered. I actually don't know. Uh, five dollars. There you go. Like a gazillion? What happened to Captain Jack? Did his ship crash? Bad he not he not home. Oh fuck 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 fuck. One flower for you, sir. Uh, no change. Don't want to change. I see how it is. Bro, these shelves are still so fucked. Wait, I can do this. Okay, it's actually not over. Check this shit out. Uh, take the box. Doesn't what? The box doesn't match the size? What the fuck is that? What I mean? Left, right, left. Whoa, holy fuck, bro. That is a big haul. Incorrect pay. Oh. Sorry, I forgot to. Wait, what? Oh, 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 shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Oh, sorry, sorry. Oh, fuck. Sorry, my finger slipped. Oh, sorry. Uh. <coughs> Eight dollars. One dollar of change? Okay. You look like someone who's going to make a big mistake tonight, am I right? Couldn't find the bottled water? Well, that's your mistake. Oh, this guy looks like a fucking dweeb. Walk away, walk away into the setting sun. I really want someone to buy that last pasta. They never will. My dreams are never gonna come true. God, I love when people pay with card. Is this how it actually feels like when you're a cashier and someone pays with card instead of cash? Fuck yes, I don't have to do math in my head. Wait, I know what to do. I would be the Wait, I actually don't know what to do. I'm uh stupid. I'm stupid and I feel like a reanimated corpse. I feel like the Uncanny Valley personified right now. I feel like I have no capacity for like actual emotion. I I can like laugh right now and I'll, I'll feel fucking nothing. I could shake your hand and my flesh will touch yours, but... There's nothing. There's nothing beneath there. All I know is... Supermarket. My cold flesh gripping yours. Absolutely nothing behind my eyes. Damn. The store is freaking hopping tonight. God damn. I'm simply not there. Tired of this slut lady with her big earrings and her booby out coming to my store acting like she's hot shit. Oh, I couldn't find the oil. Oh. What are we gonna use it for, huh? Take, taking pictures of taking pictures for your only fan fans? I'm not human anymore. I I actually feel like an alien masquerading as a human. My heart is beating Boinky in my chest, dong but it is simply just an organ. Nothing more. Uh, to you too. Thank you. 
I'm not real. I'm actually not real. I'm not a real person. I'm a cartoon character. Just eggs? Uh, cool. Is she always like this? I'm slightly concerned. No, no. Sometimes I'm worse. Let's see. We still are having a little bit of a pasta problem. <laughs> you know what I'll do? No, that's not what I'm gonna do. That would be stupid as fuck. I was gonna say I was gonna buy more pasta and then just use the pasta box, but then I'll run out of space because there'll be more... Oh god, there's... Fuck, I'm so fucking mad about pasta. Oh. <sighs> My body is just a fucking, like, mass of, like, flesh, muscle, tissue, bone, nervous system, moving around. There's, like, organs inside of me churning and farting. Please buy the pasta. Why doesn't anyone... What's wrong with this pasta that's sitting by itself? You know what? We're doing a special! We're doing a special on pasta! One dollar off! Oh, fuck! <laughs> <laughs> We're selling... Gold-encrusted Roy's, Rolls Royce of pasta. It's platinum. You can only buy it if you're on the platinum mem membership plan. Okay, we need... Yeah. We need hiccup, we need flour. Flour, oil... Let's buy another furniture. Let's buy a fringe. Wait, then we won't have enough money to restock. Damn, man. Running a supermarket is kind of stressful. Not as much as being a streamer, though. Bills... All bills paid. Oh. I gotta make payments on my loan. You know what? Let's just make payments on these for now and just stock up on what we need. A tiny world. Welcome to the tiny world. You're feeling big in a tiny world. I'm in the tiny world and I feel so big looking down on all the little twigs. I am a giant and they are an ant. My life is large and theirs is scant. They were crawling up into my pants. It made me want to do a dance. New, new pet shop boy song. She supermarkets on my peanuts until I sell. She defaults on my loan until I bankrupt. Out my. Penis. Milk. Flour. Oil. Coffee, tea. Okay. And cheese, I guess. I guess let's end the day. Bro. We, we're making a good profit so far. Okay, closed. We need... Milk. Coffee, tea, flour. And oil. I didn't add to cart. I'm fucking stupid. Suddenly... I turn around. I see it there. A short stack. Thick gobbo girl. Getting quirked up. Okay, I don't need that much oil. $52 left? Um, I'd say that's a win. Have you ever seen Iggy as Aaliyah freestyling? And she's like... Born on the farm, born on the farm. I was born on the farm in Australia. Born on the farm with a farm dog. And I win, 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 I win. 16 in the middle of Miami. Cheese goes in here. Raise price on tea? But what if people get mad at me for doing that? What if they want to kill me? What if everyone who comes into the store is thinking about killing me? Oh my god, what the fuck have I done? 
This looks like shit. Okay, you can just admit it. My store looks like shit. I'm a horrible cashier and everything just fucking sucks. Okay, just admit it. I get it. You don't... No, no. You don't have to keep sugarcoating it. My store is shit. Everything is shit. And I should just give up. Everything is fucking disaster. And everyone hates me. I don't care. I don't care. You guys are fucking lying. Okay, let's put the tea and raise the price on it and uh, scam everybody. Store's mid. You're cool. Oh, so my store's mid. Okay, okay. Yeah, sorry my store isn't the fucking Megan Fox of stores. I'm sorry, but not sorry. I'm sorry that I tried so hard and you just didn't care. I'm sorry that I opened up my store and tried my best and you just didn't give a shit. I'm sorry that I couldn't be good enough. I'm sorry that my store wasn't everything that you wanted. And I'm sorry... Most of all, it's myself. For trusting you. For believing you. I really need to rectify this pasta situation. Mmm... Market price, five ten. Okay, let's make it six dollars. Three dollars of profit. Pretty nice. Make my day. And I'm increasing the bread to three dollars. I do not give a shit. Or piss. Don't be sorry, be better. Classic neurotypical thing to say. Oh, next next you're gonna tell me to do yoga and drink more water. And not guzzle gallons of diet coke every day. Next, you're gonna tell me to go outside and stop scrolling Twitter and getting really mad about things on Twitter. Next, you're gonna tell me to stop bathing in my own urine and putting urine in a little shot glass and pouring it into my eyeball because I think it cures my cancer. <sighs> Sounds about white. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> Do not stop doing that. Yeah, true. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna stop doing that. I might get cancer. Um, that last one is fine. Okay, I'll keep doing the the urine and the eye thing. Um. Okay. You know what? Maybe the monkeys at the zoo had it all figured out when they were just sitting on a branch, pissing into their own mouth. We have fifty two dollars, and our store is looking good. There's a special going on the, uh, the pasta. Wait, maybe this box is big enough. No. What about this box? What matches the size of pasta? This? <gasps> oh my god. Bro. No, 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 no. Oh my fucking god. Bro. Oh my god. The pasta tragedy has been averted. Okay, what can we fill up these shelves with? We have $50. We need flour. Fuck, why not? Let's just buy a shit ton of shit. Okay, um... What else? Flour... We have a bunch of sugar. Awa! Awa! Awu! 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 We need more bottle water. And, um... Why don't we just get more bread? I think bread is chill. Everybody likes bread, unless they're gluten intolerant. To which I say, um, tolerate it. You know what? Fuck it. We don't need coffee. Fuck coffee. Is... This is gonna make your pee smell bad anyway. Shit. Where can I put the bread to where it will make sense and not look stupid? Hold on. Can I collect the oil in this? No. Fuck. Do you think you're better off alone? I need this playlist. I just, uh, I typed in 90s rave music on Spotify. That's how I got it. 
Yours might be kind of different because of the funky little Please algorithm thing. And I'm looking forward to seeing you all. Whoa, is that... Wait, Chill for Veil! It's Chill for Veil! Chill for Veil! Yo, how was your stream? Did you have a fun time? I'm, uh... Losing my mind playing a supermarket. I'm actually, uh... Deteriorating mentally at rapid speeds. I, I feel inhuman right now. I feel like completely out of touch with reality. How was your day? Fuck, I can't get rid of this oil. I'm gonna have to... Okay, don't make fun of me for bring, putting my bread right here. Oh no, all the popular girls are gonna come to the store and gossip about how my bread is right here and right here at the same time. They're gonna come in here smelling like Aber zombies. Ugh. Okay, let's throw this away. Might as well. We don't need it. I don't need it. I don't need it. Thank you so much for the raid. I hope you have a chill-ass day. Did you guys have fun in Silver Stream? We saw Booby all as well. Where did, where did you see Booby? Wait, what game was she playing? Oh, was, oh she was playing Cyberpunk. Okay. Everything looks good. I'm just double-checking stuff. I'm, uh... <laughs> Sorry, the store is opening late today because I have anxiety. Cyberpunk booby. It's made out of graphics cards. In the future, I think girls... They, they should make robot girls that are just like gaming PCs, but they have a pussy on it. <sighs> the perfect woman, am I right? I can fuck her, and she can run Crisis at maximum settings. And I can play Minecraft with every single realistic mod installed, and it gets her really heated up. It makes her fans run at maximum speed, and the graphics card temperature gets really, really high, and that's when I stick it in. I get my futuristic sex doll all... I load up, uh, 4K water texture. I load up, uh... Procedurally generated realistic Minecraft girlfriend mod on her, and then, uh, bro, it makes the graphics card up to at least, like, 7 degrees Celsius. Roblox are in the game, your choice. In indie game GF or Roblox game D GF? The choice is yours, Western man. <laughs> Red-pilling my indie game GF about Gamergate. And telling her about the story of Based Mom. The cool feminist. Who told me it's okay if when I play a video game and there's a girl in a bikini, it's okay if I get a half chub. And I'm not evil for it. What those fucking feminazis told me. My parents make me feel guilty enough about jacking off. I don't need a feminazi to tell me that when I'm booting up Dead or Alive Beach Volleyball, okay? Only half, no more. Yeah, just half. Just a half chub. A polite chub. If I had a penis, I think it would be at a half chub like all the time because I'm simply just like really happy to be here all the time. I'm just so like... I have like such a zest for life and I'm always so like excited and like positive that I think I would have like a half boner everywhere I go. Not for like a weird reason. It's just like like when a dog gets like really excited and like has like the red rocket thing. That would be me. This is so me. <laughs> I would roll up to the function with a half chub and be like, you know what guys? I really needed this. I look at all my friends and be like, guys, you know what? I'm having so much fun. I really needed this today. I'd be that friend. That is so true. Do you ever have those moments where you're just like having such a good time with your, your friends or with like anybody you care about? And you just like pause for a moment and just reflect on the gratitude that you're feeling? Thank you for your super pog streams and the half chum. You're welcome, Chilvo Vale. I hope you have an awesome day. I hope your day is awesome sauce.
Just glad to be here, fellas. Yeah, bro, don't be afraid to tell your friends that. It seems like really gay in the moment when you're saying it and... It... Don't let them... Don't let them uh, make fun of you for it. You just gotta express your gratitude sometimes. I don't know. The other night, me and Ethel got really, really high and walked to 7-Eleven and bought a shit ton of sweets and went home and watched a horrible reality TV. And I was just sitting there like, man, like... This really is a beautiful life. I'm so glad I'm on this earth right now. What, guys? I really needed this. I got sweet tarts, uh, the sweet tart ropes. They're like, uh, these like chewy gummy rope things and they're a little bit tart, a little bit sour. They're so fucking good. And, 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 bro, 7-Eleven has these things that are like uncrustables, but way better. And they're called like peanut butter pockets. And they're so cheap too. They're like, they were like 99 cents, I'm pretty sure. And you get like a huge ass like pop tart shaped, really soft, chewy... Delicious peanut butter and jelly. But, I mean, you don't have to believe me if you don't want to. You probably think it sounds stupid. <laughs> Three dollars of change? Oh my god, I love Nerd's Rope. Nerd's Rope is way better than just regular Nerd's. Uh, wait, uh, I think I made a little boo-boo. There you go. Oopsie poopsies. I guess you're getting a free dollar. We're doing a supermarket sweepstakes today. Oh, we need more bottle water. I wish the lights would turn on automatically. Maybe I can hire someone who can turn on the lights for me. Just like a guy that just stands there and... Clicks it on at 7 o'clock every night. Every night, every day, every night. Day and night, the lonely stoner clears his mind at night. <laughs> Does anyone else hate that fucking song? It's like one of those songs where it sounds really chill. It has a really nice beat, but when you listen too closely to the lyrics, you just start like wincing really, really hard. Like, ooh. <laughs> I wanna see the rainbow high in the sky. We need more choco cereal and more stuff on the fly. We need more sugar. We need more sugar. Holy fuck. Oh, $20? Nice. Huge. Oh, you're looking very unsightly with your nipples protruding in that disgusting shirt today. Have a very bad day. This is evil supermarket now. I changed my mind. I'm, I'm tired of being nice to everybody who comes in. I'm changing it to evil supermarket. I'm selling evil oil, evil flour, evil... Evil tea, evil bread. Oh. This is what you're buying? Have an awful day, you piece of shit. Ah, oh, Your card declined. Have a bad day. Go... Go get hit by a car. Soon dairy supermarket. Oh my god. I would actually feel like I died and went to waifu heaven if I went to a supermarket in Japan that was run entirely by soon dairy anime girls. Oh my god. Oh my god. Please release me from this eternal fucking torment. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. Please just fucking kill me. Okay. Chocolate cereal? What else do we need, guys? Eggs, cheese... Eggs and cheese. Pretty please? Do we need coffee? Nah. 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 We need more breads. We could always use some more breads. Um... Let's finish the day up. Ah. I'm selling poison bread. I think we need more pasta, too. Wait... Settings? I swear to god there was a way to change the name of your store. Maybe I asked that question three times and didn't look at the chat when someone answered it and uh... It's my fault. 
I like to move it. This is what the limo sings in Madagascar. One day blinding soup. I shall take away your sight. Oh, what's the matter? You couldn't find something in my store? Now try to find your friends and family. You have seven days. There is a shipping container somewhere by the bay. And I'm tickling them. I'm taking a little feather and I'm tickling their ear with it. I'm making them step on a Lego over and over. Oh, uh, where's my fucking shipment? Oh, there it is. Do you think we have enough? Wait, it's 375 for the big fridge, right? Should we get another just normal shelf? I feel like we should. We could be rolling in Dosh if we maximize our shelf space. More shelf space, more more stuff. Because we're kind of like reaching a point where we have the money to stock up on a ton of shit, but just not space. Here we go. Wait. There's so much like empty real estate back here. Oh no, Bow Wow. Okay, here's the biological eggs. Freshly harvested. Jeez, how come how come your supermarket lets you have three shelves? Oh fuck yeah. I'm maximizing efficiency right now. I'm a god. Among mortals. Put the cheese in here. Nice, 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 nice. Oh my god, my customers are gonna be so excited to see... Why did I get so much fucking flour? They're gonna walk in here and be like... Yo, dude, Ma I didn't know it was so chill in here. Nern root in stock. I'm trying to make some potions. Uh, we're fresh out of Nern root. Some fucking Khajiit came and bought it all. Some dirty fucking Khajiit. Okay, let's put the pasta underneath the oil because I feel like that's like a natural place for the pasta to be. No offense. Damn, now with the extra space, the real estate, it looks so empty in here. We have $86, so... Should we just... Hmm... Hmm... What do? Maybe... Should we just buy up a bunch of cheap shit? Products. What's the cheapest stuff we can buy to fill our shelves? 34, 44... Oil? Oil is pretty lit. Sugar, pretty lit. The coffee and tea is hella expensive. How about like a shit ton of bread? Why not? More breads, please. There, there, there. What do you think is needed? A little more... A little more empathy. I think that's what everybody needs. Just a little more empathy and understanding. Oh, fuck yeah, it's this song again, but different. It's just like working in a retail store. <laughs> yes! I love when this song, but slightly different version comes on. Oh, fuck yeah! Um... Ooh, this is a nice remix, though. Okay, let's put the, the susu up here. The sus sugar. There's a, something a little bit sus about this sugar. And oil. Just because this shelf is looking a little bit lonely. Put it over here. La da dee da dee da. Should we decrease the price of oil? Or increase? Should we decrease the increase? I feel like nobody's buying oil. Hmm... Increase? Always increase? Should we make it like five dollars? 
Yeah, when are all the Americans gonna come to my store? Got fresh oil over here. They don't need to be uh, messing around and, uh, I don't know, starting wars with people. Um... Man, I'm self-conscious. My store looks like dog doo-doo. It looks like trash. It's stupid. And I have so many loans to repay. Fuck. Oh my gosh, this is so embarrassing. I don't even have enough to pay rent. Oh well. Okay, open again. Back in business. Hmm. You're selling below market value? That's the draw of my store. Everyone comes to my store like, Oh my god, the price is here. So easy breezy. Okay, fuck. I'll make it like uh, $5. What's the market value on this bread? Four seventy-five. We'll make it four. What's this? Uh, three dollars. You know what? Fine. You guys made me mad. Now I'm increasing all the prices. This is why we can't have nice things. I'm gonna, I'll keep the pasta at two dollars. I kind of like that. Cereal, five bucks. I got bills to pay. Sorry. You know how it is. I'm sorry. I'm not perfect. I'm sorry. I'm just human. I'm sorry that I feel. I'm sorry that I have emotions. Here, here's your change. Have a nice day. <laughs> yeah, we gotta... We gotta go stake out the competition and just go, uh... Practice a little anarchy in their store. I'm gonna hire someone to go to all the competitor stores... ...and just, uh... ...do something, like, really abhorrent in the middle of the store. Just, like, have diarrhea in one of the aisles. Uh, clean up on aisle four. I'm gonna put up a big sign on the competitor store that says, uh, like, a sex offender works there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thanks for shopping here and not at that pedophile store down the block. Yeah, our prices are good and there's no pedophiles here. It's a win-win. James Bond. He's probably using all that flour to do like a secret mission to see the 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 trip the red trip wire things. Scream they did this to me while sitting on the floor. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it was you! It was you! Um... Having a mental breakdown and like shitting yourself in public is something that would be really awful, but it'd be so funny if it happened. It could be a really funny story in retrospect. Nice. Uh, what's, what are you doing over here, Mr. Bond? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is this song? Oh, having a good day, uh, coffee, sugar, and some tea? Oh! Feeling a little sweet today, huh? <laughs> well, have a nice day. Uh, what do we got here? Card? Alright, your total is $16. Thank you so much, have a nice day. Can't wait for the day to be over. Uh, what do you have here? Uh, sugar and cheese and milk? Uh... I feel so bad for your toilet. I don't wish it was me, though. I definitely do not wish your toilet was me. I definitely do not wish that I could, like, transform into your toilet and be there tonight after you're done eating all that and just be on the receiving end of all that. Oh my god, that was... Oh my god, oh my god. Don't even get me started. That would be horrible. I don't want to think about it. Definitely not thinking about like slowly morphing into a toilet and being on the receiving end of uh the greasy fat shit that you're going to take later. Forty-five dollars in chains. Nice. It's more than my my ex-wife left me. <sighs> my therapist taught me this uh, exercise for coping with coping with my my troubles at home by uh you know like my wife and kid they bother me every fucking day and. Sometimes it just gets so stressful, you know, and I, I've tried, uh, cognitive behavioral, behavioral therapy and all that jazz. The works, you know, I've tried like having like a journal, writing down my gratitude for everything. 
So I've been just like going outside and just uh, practicing what I would do. Like if I were to kill them, I would never like I'd never dream of it. If, uh, never in a million years. But I something like I like to go through the motions. It's like a calming exercise. It's just like a rehearsal, a dress rehearsal. Apparently LSD cures anxiety. Yeah, if you microdose it, I guess. That's so brave of you. Yeah. I'm just uh, raising mental health awareness, you know? Trying to stay positive. <laughs> that oil ain't cheap, you know? Jeez, buy up my entire stock, will ya? Holy! No, it's okay. Don't... Don't... It's, it's fine. It's actually fine. I'm not mad. God. Can't wait for them to leave. $15? Uh, nice. No change. Yeah. No. It's fine. It's whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Fine. I don't care. I don't give a shit. No. 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 Everything's fine. I'm... I'm, I'm just... I'm just chilling. It's fine. No. 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 I'm fine. Nothing's bothering me. Oh, fuck. Eggs are too expensive for you? Oh, market price is three ninety eight. Oh. You think you're too good to buy my eggs? I think this is just one big fucking joke. Whoa, it's the dude in like the the white suit. It's like those guys in Bacchanal that wear white for their like gang uniform because they, they want the blood to show up on it better. God, Bacchanal is such a good show. I want to watch it again. I feel like it's been long enough to where I've forgotten what happens in it for the most part. And I can watch it again. Sometimes I wish I could bludgeon myself over the head repeatedly to forget certain shows and like movies I've watched and games that I've played. You know how they have, like, legal euthanasia in some countries? They should do that, but with, like, amnesia. Like, legal... Consensual amnesia. They just get a doctor to give you brain damage so you'll forget something. Th that's just fucking... Uh, that's fucking eternal spotless mind. Jim Carrey movie. <sighs> I want that, but without, like, the depressing shit, but more with, like... I want to forget what it was like to play Final Fantasy for the first time. <sighs> yeah, defragment my brain. Like that little mini game you can play with your computer. I had a friend in high school who said that she... <laughs> for like computer maintenance, she's like, yeah, I defragment my hard drive like every other day. It's like good for your computer. It's like computer maintenance. It's like a like a spa treatment for your computer. And she would just like sit there like uh, cracking your knuckles like oh, yeah. Yeah, just defragmenting my laptop real quick. Hold on. <laughs> just every every single day almost. Damn. That was a good ass day. We can buy another license, too. Can we buy one right now, even though it's closed? Ooh, more... More stuff. Oh, great, more stuff to consume. I can't wait to consume. Can't wait to give corporations my money. Can you buy a license to kill? Now, when can I run, like, a mafia racketeering operation out of my supermarket? Now, we only sell licenses to chill here. I don't have mental illness, I have mental chillness. Ooh! You know what? This is pretty good prog. Pretty good prog in our humble little store, I must say. I have to pee so bad. I just looked at the time, and it's pretty much time for me to go anyway. 
So I might as well just fucking leave. Fine. I might as well just fucking leave and go pee and go eat food and just fuck off. <laughs> Bro, this is the worst setup ever. What is this? What have I done? Can I move this? Fuck, it doesn't match the size. Damn it. I still don't know. I can't tell if I accidentally took twice my recommended Adderall dose or if I'm just like sleep deprived. I feel like a reptile. I feel like I want to go like bask on a rock and like lick my eyeball with my tongue. I I'm stimming out. Oh fuck! The inside of my brain right now just looks like the like blue ball machine thing. This like. This shit. God. It's like every time I try to like say something or like have any kind of like real emotion or answer a question or have an opinion, it's just like it, my thought goes like through the tube right here and comes out, goes through the d digitally do and goes through the pneumatic bank tube that you get like the your thing in when you go through the drive through. Oh my god! Ah! It was gonna be a fucking panic attack. Holy fuck, I can't stare at it for too long. That's what God looks at when he sees all of his creations. That's what God sees when he looks down on the earth. Well, yeah, that was a YT Mundy thing. When God sees you fapping your pee pee and he's like, Jeez, dude, you're doing it to anthropomorphic planes again? Well, I'm not judging. And he gives you a thumbs up? Fuck, my store looks like dog shit. I have like bread over here, and randomly bread over here. One bag of flour just by its lonesome on this shelf. I think we did a good job though. I think I made some good prog. I felt, like, pretty focused. I felt like I accomplished something. I did? I did! I did! If God sees all, he watches all the bad tub streamers 24-7. And he blesses the water that they're in and turns it into holy water. <laughs> okay, that's it for me today. I have to go pee really, really bad. Aren't you supposed to sell the items at a much higher price? What, you think I'm a bitch? I care about my customers. I want them to be happy. I... I don't care about making money from my supermarket. What, you think I want to, like... Be like a big show-off, big, big boy on campus? And assume that everyone has the money to buy bread for market value? Classic neurotypical line of thinking. It ain't much, but it's honest work at the bread and flour and oil store. When can we start selling doo-doo? Ooh, I want to sell, like... I don't know, toilet paper and, like, sus products, like Preparation H or something. And give people a, a knowing glance, like, you're gonna use that to wipe your butt later, aren't you? Ooh! Somebody's gonna use that to wipe their booty hole later. And then every time every time you buy toilet paper or any kind of product like that, the cashier is definitely thinking about what you look like sitting on the toilet wiping your ass every time. Where? Bro, I love this song. I first heard this song on the South Park album when I was like 10 years old. I didn't know it was a real song. I thought it was like a parody. Oh, hey, Hina. Oh my god, the Glasgow Willy Wonka experience was so fucking insane. It was like, bro, there's this advertisement for this like cool Willy Wonka world thing you could take your kids to. And people got there and it was just like an empty, dilapidated PUBG map. Like abandoned looking warehouse with a bunch of like balloons and shit in it. 
With like people dressed up in Party City costumes looking depressed as fuck working there. <laughs> the fuck, the fucking entity, the chocolate entity. You've been a bad boy. You've been a greedy bad boy. The chocolate entity is going to take you into his chambers now. Okay, I have to be so bad. I'm going to die. I'm going to actually die. 